Right now I'm taking neurobiology, biomedical practicum, um, functional anatomy, and physics too. A heavy course load for any university student, let alone for one that's graduating at only 17 years old. When I was 14, I was ready to start courses at Del Mar. Ashley so Dulce had 48 college credits by the time she got her high school diploma, transferring over to Texas A&M Corpus Christi when she was 15. I made it a point to not tell anyone how old I was. I didn't want any special treatment or handouts or anything. I wanted to earn my way just like any other student would. She has a bit more maturity uh, in spite of her age than a lot of other students do, and she's very well focused. A biomedical sciences major, Dulce dreams of becoming a surgeon. I love biochemistry. I just think it's really interesting. This past year, um, sitting in on a surgery. It was incredible. I mean, um, in the room, I told myself if I wasn't sure before, which I was sure, but if I wasn't sure before, I am absolutely positively certain this is, this is what I want to do. This is where I want to be. Her professor, Dr. Gregory Buck, says she's got a bright future ahead of her. I first tried to persuade her to go for a PhD, but I understand she wants to go for, to be a physician. So I've been giving her advice at, about how to take the MCAT. I know you're probably aiming for what, 5, 10? Dulce will take her MCATs in April and graduate shortly after, then apply to medical school. Credit should be given to um, a great support system that I formed, um, my family, my incredible professors. They've been wonderful and they've really helped me throughout my experience. Leaving this advice for young minds like her own. I think it's just really important to have a goal and to work for it. Um, you don't have to know exactly what you want to do, but if you do, that's great, and I mean, go for it. Taylor Alanis, 3 News.